YouTube, my name is Kays, and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video. I'm going to be talking about some things that I like in DLC 3, so let's get straight into it. First of all, I would like to say to you guys that I'm going for the Red RC, and that's why you see all that stuff in the title. And, you know, even if I don't make it in red, whatever, it's fine. I just want to go for something. I like doing this stuff because it gets me something to actually work for and go for. Now, so I want to talk to you guys about DLC 3 here and my opinions and thoughts on each multiplayer map. I'm not a big Zombies fan, so I can't really judge the Zombies part. It definitely does look cool, but I'm not going to be like, yeah, I'm definitely going to play that because I don't really know much about Zombies. So first of all, the first thing I love about it is that they're actually bringing back Raid, which is a huge thing for us, you know, people that actually play Black Ops 2. Raid is a really, really good map, so I'm very happy that they're bringing that back. And I think it's going to be a good remake. A lot of these maps in this DLC, can, they kind of look medieval. They don't look futuristic, which that's what everybody kind of wants, so they listened. In the last DLC, we saw Spire, which was more a futuristic map. But we're not really seeing that in this DLC. Next up, I want to talk about the second map, Cryden, or Cryogen. I'm not exactly sure, but that map kind of looks like a big, you know, Empire Castle type of thing. Because a lot of these maps, once again, they do look very medieval-ish. So it looks like a little castle, and it actually looks really, really cool. It's got like a blue ice theme to it as well. We didn't really get any uh, close-ups about these maps or any like previews of them. We just got pictures. So that's kind of an annoying thing about it, but you know, the pictures do say a good amount. Cryogen, it looks like a really cool map. It looks like it's going to be an indoors map, not an outdoors map. But for the next map, Berserk, it looks like it's kind of indoors and outdoors. If you guys look at it, it looks like a little palace just like the other map but it's like a dojo it that's what it looks like to me it looks like a little dojo on a cliff or some sort um because there's a lot of rocks around it which that looks really really cool i'm a very big fan of all these maps what we've seen for dlc3 i think they actually look really really cool uh the last map rumble it looks like it's an outdoors map um but there's two outdoors two indoor maps from what i'm seeing right now I think they all look pretty cool, though. They do look really awesome. I think that it's got a good tone to it. Like, no one wants futuristic stuff anymore. So they kind of went back in the past. Not too, like, far back in the past, but they did bring it to, like, where people could enjoy it. So big ups to Treyarch. That's actually a really cool thing that they did that. And I think that the maps are going to be actually a really good DLC. The first ma uh, first DLC... Not many people liked it. Um, Splash was a good map that people liked, but nothing other than that. The second one, people were iffy about it. You know, not too many people liked it. Some people liked the Spire, though. That was one of my favorite maps in that. And then this DLC, we've got really good, you know, intentions from everybody. So, for me, I love it. It's a, it looks like a really good map. So far, we haven't really seen anything of it. Um, but from the pictures, I do give it my thumbs up. So, it does look cool. But yeah, those are my thoughts and opinions on the maps. I think that it's going to be a good DLC. That's in my opinion. After seeing all them, it looks like it's going to be a good one. So I'm very excited for it to come out. It comes on July 12th, so that's very exciting. Um, it's going to be... It's going to be cool. I think a lot of people are going to dig it. Of course, you got mixed emotions from everybody. And I've heard nothing but good things from the people that, like, play the zombies and such. So, I think overall, the DLC will be A-OK. -okay. That's going to be it for the video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you leave a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below. I really do appreciate it. If that like button is not to 45 likes, make sure to give it a like. 45 likes is the like goal for today's video. So, that would be awesome if we can get that amount of likes if you're on this part of the video in the comment section i want you guys to comment hashtag dlc3 so i know you guys are it would mean the world to me i hope you guys have yourselves a great day you've been the case crew i've been case i'll see you all in the next one peace out